Welcome to Stave Draws. This is the Manual of Procreate, Part 23, Transform, Section 2, Advanced Manipulation. This section will explain the power of the distort and shear tools. Distort. Procreate's impressive distort feature makes three-dimensional scenes a piece of cake. Engage Distort by tapping and holding your finger over any corner transform node. A notification will let you know that Distort has been activated and you can begin to distort the object. The artwork here is a great example of using Distort to create a perfect three-dimensional scene. Paint your textures as if you were looking at them from front on or top down. Once you're finished painting, distort it into place to get a perfect perspective in a fraction of the time it would make to paint it manually. Shear Shearing is like tilting or tipping an object. It can be handy for creating depth or slight angles. To shear an object while in transform mode, tap and hold a middle blue node until the notification appears. To restrict the shear's movement to a single axis, turn magnetics on. Nudge. Nudge your object slightly in any direction by tapping outside the bounding box. Tap outside your object to move your object left, right, up or down in tiny increments. The nudge distance will be affected by zoom level. So the closer you are to your painting, the smaller the nudge will be. Zoom, Pen, Shortcut While transforming, it is possible to move your view around with committing your changes. Hold the Transform button and Zoom Pinch to adjust your view. Let go of the Transform button to go back to transforming your object. If you want to know more about Procreate, just visit my playlist and the playlist has all the topics about Procreate.